Parshas Vayera. Wow. Okay, so you have this crazy event where Avraham it gets a circumcision. He's sitting outside, recovering from his his weakness. Is is you know from the procedure. He's an old man, so it takes a lot of time to recover. And um, he he's visited by these. It's a, it's a big question what they are. Some say angels, random desert people. And he's commu communicating with God, and he sees these people pass by, and he jumps up, and he has this whole thing with them. Now, it's an interesting thing, because you think you're communicating with God, and then you, you run to, to, to do this gift of, you know, what we would call like welcoming the stranger. What's the insight? So we are always trying to find the next best thing and setting up circumstances in our life so that they will be advantageous. Whenever I ask myself, someone else, like, what do you need to be successful? We always talk about things that are not necessarily relevant to us, right? So it's like, I need more cash flow. I need better people in my business. I need more opportunity. I need a wife. I need a, kids that are like X, Y, and Z. And the interesting thing is, that what we really need is to become somebody else. Because all of the things, that, that's the point of Abraham, is that all of the things that are in his life are his path, right? There's no, there's no better situation, right? He saw that the situation that was in front of him was the best possible situation. So when he saw the opportunity, he went for the opportunity. And the opportunity was not like, let me find some better guests, or I'm already talking to God, so I gotta let that one go by. No, he was just there in his life. And that's ultimately what the definition of being present means, is it's like, you're not waiting until tomorrow, or the next day, or the different situation to change. No, it's on you. It's on your ability to open up your eyes and to actually, for five seconds, be present with the things in your life. And look around and like, that's where I'm supposed to be right now. This is the situation I'm supposed to be in right now. And now, how do I, it, and it, 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 how do I get that lesson in my life? How do I just learn that everything there, this is it. It's as good as it gets, because this is all it's going to be. And to, and to leave all of this other nonsense of all of these other things that have to be different, because it's like, that's not where you are, man. That's not your, that's not your future. That has nothing to do with reality. Reality is, just look around right now. What do we do about what's going on? Shabbat Shalom.